Hello guys, I just got out to shower, wash my hair, and today is going to be a fun day because first I'm going to Oxford Street and hopefully we can see the lights. And um, after that I will go to the Winter Wonderland at Hyde Park and I thought I would take you guys along with me because I think it's going to be great and fun and maybe you're interested so stay tuned for the rest of the video if you want to see what winter wonderland in london looks like coffee at Ralph Lauren actually and it was very good this is what the shop looks like from the outside and besides that you can see what new Bond Street looks like with the Christmas lights on which I think is awesome it looks so nice this is such a cool street it's go check out new Bond Street because there is so much to see and you can take so many sweet pictures with so many different um christmas lights up this is supposed to be like looking like an, this one animal and i think it's crazy where i'm from we don't have these kinds of lights <laughs> this is fortnum and mason from the inside with its little uh, lights and they change colors oh my god We are finally here, you can already see the lights a little bit and yeah, I'm excited. We booked a few um, adventures inside. So already. let's see if it was worth it or if the hype is too much. So there are different entrances and we're starting at the Blue Gate, which is where the ice rink is. Yay! So as you can see, there's a lot of things you can do. And as I said, we're starting with the ice skating, which is right behind me. We just got our skates. You give them your shoes and you get your skates. Here you can see already some of the ice rink, like the lights. Hey guys, we're done with ice skating and are looking through the Christmas market right now. And after that we will go to the Magical Ice Kingdom. And I'm um, already very excited. We had to wait a little bit for our shoes and stuff. But the ice skating part was very nice. So in Germany we call the chimney cake Baumstürze and it's the best thing ever. You'll have to try it if you ever get the option. So guys, I don't know if you've ever been to a Christmas market, but in Germany that's like an adventure park. Not a Christmas market, but yeah. apparently it has different parts, so that's just uh, not the Christmas market. Behind me, you 
can see the Bavarian village where we will go later because maybe you guys don't know but I'm from Bavaria so we wanted to check out how Bavaria is seen by English people They have all kinds of different street food here but that's awesome and it's just right next to the giant Guys, right now we're walking towards the magical ice kingdom and apparently there is like an ice sculpting workshop so This is the magical ice kingdom, guys. It is freaking magical. There's the house completely out of ice. Oh my god. Let's look behind it. Oh my god. Money. Every ice tile plays like a story. Guess in the comments which one this is. That was the magical ice kingdom and now on to the giant wheel. After that we made it to the Bavarian village and played some little games and uh, drank some more Glühwein and it was in general a very nice night. So if you are like in London right now or in winter sometime, you should definitely go to Winter Wonderland. It's so much fun. We are now done in the Winter Wonderland and in a taxi there's the Ritz. I don't know if you guys can see it, but I actually want something. Yay! Uh, um, I don't even know what it's called. Like polar something. I will blend in the right name right here over my face. <laughs> and right now we're driving home. I am very happy with uh, what we did. The giant wheel was also a success, I would say for me. It was a lot of fun, there's so much stuff to do, to eat, to drink and to see. So you should go check it out. It is there for like the whole winter, so go have fun. Mm -hmm. 